What's up, fellow humans? What up, homies? <laughs> I'm Krishar. I'm Crystal. And we're Charm Noir. And we got something big coming up. Yes, we do. On January 24th, we are starting our first series of group soul journeys. And what does that consist of? That gets you one hour weekly sessions with us. Yes, for 10 weeks, we are your mindfulness coaches. What that entails is we are your trigger points, we are your taskmasters, we are like your disciplinary parents, we are coming to show you where you need correction in your life so you can get in alignment with your motherfucking self. There you go. Then we also provide you with some individual and some ancestral shadow work, integration work. And so we're going in. So what are those things that's hidden in the bloodline that you still acting out that you're not quite aware of? That thing that people always be like, you know you doing that? And you be like, no, I'm not. Maybe we're going to take a further, deeper look at what that thing is so you can stop doing it because you're tired of people telling you that shit. What else we got for them? We got weekly assignments to help you with self-reflection. We got tools to make sure to help you gain what? Your emotional intelligence. So you want that thing of... You want to make sure it's okay to be angry, but you want to make sure that when you're angry, the right person is receiving the end of that anger. And not your children, not your partner, if that's not who you're really angry at. So we're going to get smarter of where we're making sure our emotions come up at. What yes. Else? And as we do this work, it's going to naturally heighten your intuition. Yeah, so you're going to gain accountability and it's going to ensure you to make sure you stay in alignment with yourself, with the creator, with your ancestors, because in this energy... It's easily to get off track. Yes. And you need help. Yes. And with this being a group session, not only do you have us as your accountability partners, you're going to have the other people in the group that we are going to hold each other accountable for staying true to our thoughts, words, and actions as they come up in these sessions. So you, want, you are not going to have time to be distracted in the chaos and confusion of the world because you're going to be too busy exploring your own what? Inner world. And that's the best part of 2021. What did you learn last year and how are you going to apply that this year? So what? No matter what it looks like out there, you still at peace within. That's what's up. Uh, we took a martial arts class one time and the martial arts teacher told us it's about finding your cool place in hell. So that's what we're going to help you do during this 10 weeks. So if you want more information, check out our website, charmnoir.com. We're going to put the link in the bios. Hit us up. Peace. Peace. My name is Hollis Bailey. I live in uh, San Jose del Cabo, Mexico. I'm originally from Oregon in the United States. And I recently completed a 10 week program with Crystal and Krishara that was more than I could have ever asked for in terms of helping me look at my white privilege, address a lot of the things that I grew up with in terms of just growing up in a really white state and a really white family, being exposed to people using the N word a lot and me feeling ashamed and guilty and never opening up, literally never until now at 37 years old, opening up that conversation until I stepped into this group. I am so grateful that I was called that um, Crystal and Krishara came into my sphere as soon as the protests began happening in the United States. I'm in Mexico, as I mentioned. I'm married to a Mexican man. There's a lot of cultural differences in my relationship. Coming from a family who has some racism happening, in, it's, it's in me, right? Um, I entered into this group very hesitantly and um, and the more uncomfortable I got, the more growth happened for me. I'm able to have difficult conversations. I'm able to sit with difficult emotions. Um, I'm able to call on more of my sisters to have these conversations, whereas before I had kind of built a basically fortress around myself. The way I describe it, what this 10 group did, 10 week group did for me is make a dent in the walls I've built around myself, um, basically keeping me safe in my ignorance. And I'm so grateful for Crystal and Krishara and the other women who showed up for this group for opening up these conversations, for making me feel uncomfortable. And we all need to be feeling uncomfortable right now. 
Um, I'm open to watching videos for hours on end now on social media, um, not reacting and not necessarily even protesting, but just just getting people's emotions and feelings and perspectives on what is going on here and what has been happening since the moment I was born, since hundreds of years ago in the country I was born in. Um, we all have a responsibility to do this work. Mine has just barely begun at 37 years old. Um, I want to give such a huge, huge piece of my heart and just express my gratitude to Crystal and Kashara for allowing the safe space for me to open up in and look at these shadow parts of myself. Um, I would come back and do this over and over and over again when I have the time and, and um, means to do so. So thank you so much, Crystal and Krishara. Thank you um, really to the universe for bringing this into my sphere and this lifetime. It's going to be a lifetime of work. It, it should be for all of us. Now that it's up, I mean, it was up a long time before my ignorance allowed me to see it. But now that it's up in my life, I can't turn a blind eye to that. And that to me is... Um, is just the biggest gratitude piece, right? Is just allowing this, this space, um, ourselves the time and the space and the community, finding people like Crystal, Crystal and Kashara to hold us as we look at these shadow parts and really um, do our personal work so that then we can go out and share it with others and break down these walls that keep us separated. Thank you so much.